so you've discovered this carnivore diet and you think it's the be all and end all of everything yeah it's really effective it is and if if you've only tried that alone diet alone you might have had so many benefits that you think that it's the cure for everything if you haven't been that sick it's probably taken you to a stage of such amazing health that you feel like you don't really need to do anything else but and this message is particularly to people who are very ill when you get that sick really the other stuff becomes so important the other stuff is probably even more important you know Jack Cruz is always telling me to stop being a diet guru and to um, be a light guru well I, I take his point I, I go on about diet so much just because this as I said before there's so much bullshit built up around it it takes um, more deprogramming really to uh, to get people to stop thinking about diet but beyond that there's so much other stuff and when you're sick it's a really good time to notice how effective that is when somebody else might not notice it and just say everything else is a load of old woo-woo well it isn't the light environment is huge you know get those blue blocking shades on i've got a video about how to sort your sleep out how to sort your circadian biology about out no no amount of good diet is going to uh, is going to help that much to reverse a disease if you're really sick um, and honestly once you do these subtler things it wakes you up to a whole new world of other subtler things if you like the whole emotional balancing area that's another one now as I've said again in other videos I, I had a time where both my ankles healed up from psoriatic arthritis while the other joints were raging away just from sorting out an emotional issue um, something I was trying not to run away from that can be connected to to joints now most people would think this is proper nonsense but I feel that it's like your gut integrity is protecting you from a lot of this other stuff so if you have a really good solid gut biome and integrity of the gut wall or whatever it, it, it protects the body from having symptoms that come from subtler things those subtler things can be anything light EMFs Wi-Fi you know all that kind of thing which you could really do with stamping out but the emotions is a much subtler thing you see when you're ill and you have symptoms they're magnified much more than anybody else's symptoms might be they might stub their toe that might be um, related to some kind of emotional thing that's trying to give you a warning but we never see it but if you get gout in that toe then you've got something serious to deal with just an example but if you then look for the emotional causes of things like say you get a book like um, The Secret Language of Your Body by Inner Seagull and just see all the different parts of the body that are related to different emotions different traumas different fears um, next time anything goes wrong have a look in that book use it as a reference book and it's amazing after a few times you'll start to think hang on a minute there's a pattern here so yeah look at your light environment look at your emotions look at your lifestyle look at everything because a diet might get you 80% better even 90% but that remaining 10 or 20% that's left once once the symptoms are taken down you can look at it better and those little things that you find in that time of quiet self-reflection and studying of other things like maybe Jack Cruz's stuff who's so hot and all the light at those times you might find the things which caused it in the first place and it will never switch off until you find these other things so there you go however good a new toy the carnivore diet is for sorting out all your problems reversing any disease or whatever don't get hung up in it it's basic it's simple do it and move on to other stuff you're going to find some miracles there honestly 
I think this is the blessing of illness where you're forced to look at stuff that you would never have looked at otherwise and that was the case with me and so now I feel on so many levels I've come out with so much more knowledge and also a better person really than I was before so yeah there's the blessing of it eat meat enjoy it and look into light Wi-Fi diet emotions sun exposure all sorts of other things I've got a load of other videos about all those things on my channel but I just seem to be branded the meat guy but I just want to say no there's more to life than meat